The Princess and the Frozen Peas. There once was a young, beautiful princess who lived in a huge kingdom. One day, a very cranky old king came to the royal palace, intending to marry the princess. Oh no! Told the princess, "I can't marry him." The king wants proof that she's a real princess before he marries her," said the said one servant. "A real princess won't be able to sleep if there is even only one tiny pea underneath a big pile of mattress," said the other. "I am a real princess." Told the prince, says, but I will pretend that I'm not. The servant crept into her room and placed a single pea under a pile of mattress. Oh, I am so sleepy, yawned the prince, and pretended to sleep. The servant watching. Said the princess, "Look, she's all sleep, sleep already. The king will be so angry." Cried one. Maybe one pea wasn't enough. Said the other rather bent. We must prove that she is a princess. The next night, they crept into her room. Lots of frozen frozen pea. Should do the trick," they whispered. "Oh, I am so terribly tired," said the princess. She began snoring loudly. The next morning, she rose with the sun. What a wonderful night! Sleep I have had. The princess smiled. The servants looked worried, but I. Really, haven't slept a wink," told the princess secretly. The servants told the king what had happened. Let's try other things that start with the letter P," said one servant. "Good ideas," said the other servant. Then. Almost as good as a real pea. The servant put some prickly pork peas nuts into her bag, but still the princess slept. They tried a pirate and a panda, a peacock, and a painter. But still, the princess slept. Soon, it was the morning of the wedding. She is not a princess," said the servant. "The the king, to call the wedding off," said the king, and he left. Phew," said the princess. She did don't have to marry the old king, and now she said. I can finally get a good night's sleep. The end.